Hello and welcome back to Vlaishish. We are still in November. It's the pretty much the end of the day. I cut off the last episode rather abrupt, rather abruptly because I wanted to show this first bit of deliveries that well the bit of delivery that we're going to be doing um, some eggs and a little bit of milk as a um, separate episode so here we are we just about a quarter to five we're going to go and pick up the eggs and then we're going to find out where to sell those and then we're going to have to look for a delivery solution for our milk I think I know what I'm going to do but we shall just wait a little while and well, we'll get we'll get this sold and then we'll check it out. Right, let's have a look and see where we can sell eggs at a decent price. So here we go. Where are we eggs? There we go, eggs. So the restaurant is where we'll go and do that, and I think I know where that is. What are the price fluctuations? Let's just check that. 4160. So we got good good money now. So let's just tag that just so that we know for sure that we're delivering to the right place. And we'll go and load those eggs. It should bring in a little bit of money. It's not going to really uh, make us rich at this point in time, but we're on our way. I'm not sure whether we're about to pick it up with this, I don't think so. I think we'll just have to hand load. Let's just go and... Uh, well, yeah. We're not going to miss that, are we? <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's just get this picked up. And so we've got a full, full, full pallet plus another bit. So 1,400, probably 1,800 ish. Pellets of, uh, not pellets, eggs. One and a half pellets. Get us going. We're on our way. We go. Let's get that hitched up. To get the lights on. We come into that time of the day. It is November, I suppose. Strap those in and go and deliver those. And then this does have a, a hitch on the back, I think, so I can go to the store and hitch up a trailer. Or the trailer that I think I'm going to use. Is an old trusty favourite, so you probably can guess what it's going to be. We'll see you at the. Well, we'll drive down with, drive down with me. Get this sort of evening view as we go through town. Go into town. All the aut autumnal colours, trees changing colours, looks looking fantastic. There we go. 
And... Yeah. Good thing about delivering at this time of the day is if you have these... Places tagged, they are... Very visible. <laughs> There we go. This is the is it the restaurant? There we go. How much are we gonna make? How much are we gonna make? We could almost pay back our loan already. <laughs> Nine thousand. Not to be scoffed at, as they say in the classics. We'll go and buy a trailer to load our milk onto, and we'll get the milk sold as well. Looking forward to that. That's just a. So it's a. Uh, yeah, that's our first income from our farm, so pretty happy with it. Can't be too long before they close. I see they've already dimmed the lights. So we're going to go to trailers, animals. And there we go. The SMP 3.0. I know it pushes it around a bit. Our tractors are a bit heavier, so we should be okay. Uh, oh, we won't carry a spare wheel, or should we? Why not? It looks good there. Um, so that comes to 2,800. It's nice and cheap. 10,000. And I do believe it does take milk. So we need to actually go back and check that. It does, yes, it does take milk. So we'll buy that. And we'll go and pick it up. Thank you very much for staying behind. Well, not staying behind, for not closing up when you saw my tractor come in. <laughs> Here we go. Let's go and load that up. And I have connected this type of trailer to to this um, SM. Yeah, there's no problem with that. Land train, land train, off we go. So this is going to be a very short episode, of course, but yeah, I, I wanted to specifically show this. Sorry, sir, we'll just pull off in front of you. Don't want to break my speed. We'll travel with this back to the to the farm, just in case anything interesting happens with the land train. Of course, everything is empty, so. It's going on at a good pace. There we go. We had to take quite a wide berth around that corner just to. Uh, we need to be a little bit careful when we turn turn into the next road. It's quite tight. Well, it's quite tight. If we are trying not to knock knock over the stop sign. I think I have knocked it over that stop sign a couple of times already. There we go. Got through okay.
Fantastical. It looks like we can take another cut across. So let's drop that off there. Walk this up here. Oops, we've got more eggs already. Not oops. Yay, we've got more eggs already. <laughs> So our next purchase is going to be a TMR mixer, but I think we've still got a lot of, still got quite a bit of hay in there. Um, might buy a couple of extra cars, I think. So I think we collect the milk down the side here. Was it the other side? I can't remember now. Hmm. Let's do. Let's get the. Markers on just to check out quickly. Yeah, the pickup is there. Hmm, so does it not want to? Maybe that's slurry. It's going to look on the other side. Yep, there must be slurry on that side. 4,344 litres. That's not too bad. Not too bad bad that's okay I'm quite happy with that for the for four cars I think um, yeah let's just get that off right where can we sell that to milk milk's probably to the dairy I suppose but <laughs> you never know and milk there so dairy Restaurant. What is the uh, November? Oh, lousy. So we uh, we're not too bad though. And milk is something that has to be sold quite regularly. So let's just tag that as well. guessing the restaurant is just around about where we're the well the restaurant is where we deliver to isn't it didn't really need to tag it I'm sure we delivered the yeah we did deliver the the eggs to the restaurant as well Case, we'll see when we get down there. Right, so here we are. We're already offloading. Another eight thousand eight hundred. Very good. Uh, 
and that puts us into a fairly good position now. So I think we'll go and buy another couple of cars and then we'll end this episode. So we'll see you once we get back to the farm. Right, so we're back to the farm. We've just dropped off the trailer. And we'll go and park this up. And then we'll buy a last lot of, uh, well, another few cars. Oops. It's not the best place to park the tractor with the front end load on it. That's better there. We've still got some tractors to bring back from the other field, but we'll do that off camera. Switch the lights off. And Of get the old torch out. Close this door so that we know. Right, let's just go and do a couple of. How they all do? Nice little plenty of straw. Good plenty of food. It's a bit of slurry that we're going to have to start thinking about moving. And we'll buy um, two, three, four. Buy another four. How are you doing, Mrs. Carr? Are you alright? Yep. looking pretty good they're all looking pretty good animal inspection over just gonna check on the chickens quickly and then we'll end this episode Three hundred and seven out of five hundred, so we've got quite a few chickens now. Male ducks. Ducklings male. So we want to really want to get rid of those. going to cost us to have the males taken away. This costs us 120 euros, but yeah, we need that f space for the for the laying hens. So, and then we don't want to buy them. What am I doing? Looking on the wrong side, aren't we? <laughs> duck, female, chicken, female, duck, male. Duckling male, that's the one we're looking for. 
51 of them. Oh, we'll, we'll get a little bit. <laughs> and we'll sell those. Duck female, chicken female, duck male, chicken chick female, chicken chick male. Fifty-four of them. There we go. That's better. We've just got the what? And the one rooster. Yep, that's good. Right, so that's that taken care of. And I think that's where we're going to end this episode. So thank you so much for watching. We're going to go and bring back the other tractors from the bottom field. And then in the next episode, we're probably going to have to do some weeding. I think this field over here needs to be weeded. Yeah, that'll be weeding, weeded. And the other one, because we duck direct drilled, so they'll both need to be weeded. So we we'll must probably have to get some herbicide in and uh, spray off the, the weeds. We need to also look and see whether we might have to sell the, the weeding equipment that we have, the sprayers that we have. Um, to be able to get some sprayers that would work with the precision farming and that in the long run will save quite a quite a bit on herbicide and of course will mean that we're putting less poison down on the fields in any case i do hope you've enjoyed this rather short episode if you have please like and subscribe and we'll catch you in the next one cheerio